Welcome to the episode today. Isn't it so good to be back? I love being back here at the studio. Every time I leave, I miss this place. I think about this place. I think about stuff I like. I, I love this place. This place just... <clears throat> do I love it? It, it just... It, it's mine. It feels comfortable. All this shit on the walls just makes me feel in this nice little like, creative cocoon. It is nice to be back. Um, in this episode today, I want to talk about comments, YouTube comments. I, I, I mentioned uh, in, in the episode, why do I keep going? Like, why do we keep doing this? Um, I think it was actually titled, why do I keep doing this? Um, about the YouTube comments that keep me going and, and how I kind of face comments. and and. After that episode, after I put that out, I was listening to, to a few podcasts and I listened to a few like snippets from some radio shows. And there's there's one that I listened to with Nikki Glaser and David Dobrik was on it, and um, and two other people were on it. I, I, I don't know who they were. I forget who they were. Um, but they were talking about YouTube comments and how David Dobrik literally reads all his comments. I don't like to read comments. I don't. Do you read comments? Do you? I read every single comment. No, you. There's yeah. just no way you do. I, no, I. That's like that's all I do. You have 16 million night. views. You really do. But it, really? I mean, the the worst comments are. Wow, I used to love these videos. That's uh, the yeah. fucking yeah, like, craziest. But the other thing is, like, positive comments, you feel nothing. You can read yeah. a thousand 100%. of them, you feel nothing. And 100%. a negative one just ruins your day. Yeah. I also read all, all my YouTube comments, and, and they were talking about, like, the best ones and worst ones to receive, and, and, and I think David Dobrik, and I think David said, uh, the best ones are, the worst ones are to receive are, like, why do we keep watching this and what happened to the old stuff? Really? I mean, the, the worst comments are, Wow, I used to love these videos. And, and he said the, the hardest thing to like get is like to see how many people unsubscribe. And, and I, I just have to say, like, someone said on the, on the show, I forget who it was, but someone said on the show. Um, <laughs> the other thing is, like, positive comments, you feel nothing. You can read yeah. a thousand 100%. of them, you feel nothing. And 100%. a negative one just ruins your day. Yeah. That's not how I see YouTube comments. That's just not how I see it. I see every comment equal, negative or positive, I see as equal. Um, I, how how I how I kind of go towards the, the 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 negative comments for at first is I I just go with them with compassion I I let them know that like I'm working on newer content and hopefully they might like and I just go with them with with trying to be nice about it um, of course if there's something like absolutely rude and and, and just not appropriate I'll, I'll pull that comment down. Or, or, or I'll, I'll address that person in, you know, not publicly because I, I feel like that's not correct. But, but like, if there's something where like this sucks, I might, I actually might, might start a dialogue with that person and, and try to be really nice and show them some compassion. And then on the positive side, I always respond to those and I always let those sit there. And, and last week was a really good YouTube comment week for me, and some older videos got some good, good love. And, and I love talking to those people. I love saying thank you so much, and, and it really does mean a lot. I know that seems like such like a, a just like a whatever kind of response, but it really does. Like I've been wanting to do this forever, and now that I have a chance to do it, and, and like like the public, like, like the world is telling me that they actually like the content I'm putting out, the heart, the content I'm working hard on, and, and I get to see that it really does mean a lot. It, it literally like fulfills a, a childhood dream that I've had to, to make content, um, and so with comments, the ones that sit the longest are the ones that mean a lot. Um, th there are some comments that, that, that I've had um, that, that that are just really positive and, and, and I'm actually going to put one up because it, it really touched my heart a lot and I'm going to put that up now. But thank you Vaztac for, for commenting that. That really means a lot. I really work hard on the aesthetic here and, and the styles of these videos. I, I try to like bring some of my influences with my own twist and my own feeling of how I want the video to go. So thank you so much for commenting that. That really just meant a lot to me. Um, and, 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 and I've had some other comments. There was another, uh, I had a whole conversation through the comments about a blue social card. Um, and and, and what, what do you do if you don't have like a, a, an RFID reader? How do you how do you combat that? How do you how do you? And so this person was asking like really good questions, and I was really there to help. Um, so again, YouTube comments are, are a way for you to like figure out what your content should be, and and, and you can kind of like like figure out what your performance is as you create your content. Like I can see some videos that, that I remember making, and I'm like this video. I'm trying to get an emotion, and that video plays better than just a regular like 
vlog be, maybe even like this, but I feel like these have to be done as well as the really fun ones. You know, it's kind of like when, when you're in a relationship, you, you get into arguments which are not really fun, and then right after the argument, you know, you have this like weird moment, then you go on a trip and it's really, really fun. It's kind of like that here on this YouTube channel. There's gonna be some stuff I talk about that's just not fun or exciting, but I just feel like it has to be said, and then there's stuff that's like really fun and really exciting, but all those, all those have to be done in order to have a full like YouTube relationship. I feel like he here between the viewer and me, and those comments are are like, here's what I want to see in our relationship, or ah, that was great. Thanks so much for doing. It. It's a gratification thing, and um, I I'm just so fortunate I can do this for a living. And I want to thank all you guys for, for watching these videos. So um, I'm gonna end this episode here. Uh, tomorrow is a big like pre-production day for me um, so I'm not quite sure what the episode will look like tomorrow but I'll try to get it as good of a quality as I can because you know all we can do is try so we'll see you tomorrow for another episode thanks for commenting see ya